All right, hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. This is a very short video and I would like you guys to share with us. I decided to make a short videos. It's kind of series of videos about while Jesus, what Muhammad was doing. So in those videos, we will compare between what Jesus was doing and what was Muhammad doing. And both is coming from the authentic sources of both the Christians and the Muslims, which means the Muslims cannot deny it. So today, and please download my videos, share it everywhere. It's for free for everybody. I'm not going to flag you for sharing my videos. And I will consider that as a missionary work if you really care to serve the Lord. Here, we will see together what Jesus was doing with the water and what was Muhammad was doing with the water. And we will compare between both. Let us listen carefully and see what happened starting with the Bible. And straightway Jesus constrained his disciples to get into a ship and to go before him unto the other side while he sent the multitudes away. And when he had sent the multitudes away, he went up into a mountain apart to pray. And when the evening was come, he was there alone. But the ship was now in the midst of the sea, tossed with waves, for the wind was contrary. And in the fourth watch of the night, Jesus went unto them, walking on the sea. And when the disciples saw him walking on the sea, they were troubled, saying, It is a spirit, and they cried out for fear. But straightway Jesus spake unto them, saying, be of good cheer, it is I, be not afraid. And Peter answered him and said, Lord, if it be thou, bid me come unto thee on the water. And he said, Come. And when Peter was come down out of the ship, he walked on the water to go to Jesus. But when he saw the wind boisterous, he was afraid, and beginning to sink, he cried, saying, Lord, save me. And immediately Jesus stretched forth his hand, and caught him, and said unto him, O thou of little faith, wherefore didst thou doubt? And when they were coming to the ship, the wind ceased. Then I mean, they I mean that way that. in the ship. I mean to that. This is how beautiful what Jesus is about. When Jesus was walking in the water, and even he gave an order to a human being like us to walk in the water, he was able to walk in the water. What was Muhammad doing with the water? We go to the books of Muslims. All of it is authentic. We have nothing to do with it. This is Muslim translation. I have nothing to do with the translation. It was narrated from Abi Sa'id al-Khudari that his father said, I passed by the Prophet when he was performing wudu from the will of Bida. I said, are you performing wudu from it when garbage is thrown into it? He said, water is not made impure by anything. The same story reported again and again. Read carefully with me, please. Uh, the people asked the Messenger of Allah, S A W S, the amazing Allah Himself, I pray on Him. This is what S A W S mean. Can we perform evolution out of the will of Buddha, which will? into which ministration menstrual clothes and dead dogs and stinking things were thrown in it he replied water is a pure and is not defiled by anything this is the teaching of muhammad and this is who is muhammad you know when 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 we hear that a person who claimed to be a prophet of god and he teach such a teaching and he jump in the water, washing himself in water, have dead dogs. Yet he teach the Muslims that dogs are dirty. And if a dog, he lick your dish, you have to wash it seven times. But yet Muhammad is washing in a little container of water, is not even six cubit wide, the height of it less than the, 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 the like uh, your private part. And all of this, women blood from period rags from women menstruation stinky water all kind of garbage is dumped there as we showed you in the previous hadith and as we see you show you here right now 
and yet Muhammad he claimed that the water is always pure so while Jesus was walking in the water Muhammad was taking a shower with dead dogs and women of blood from period and a stinky garbage all of this in a little little tiny container of water which is a sewage here you will see the Muslim measuring how big this thing is as you see in the front of your screen imagine in a size of a water we have only six, six, six cubit of water only six and we have the height of your private part and in that small tiny water which maybe is in the size of your living room we have dead dogs you see here this is the height of it it is the height of the private part so in this little tiny water we have it's like a jacuzzi uh, you know top we have dead dogs we have women of blood from period we have all kind of garbage and yet Muhammad he claimed that water is always pure now I'm not going to talk much about the miracle Jesus did because the miracle explained itself but I'm going to explain how and what kind of a person Muhammad he was do you think a person who have little brain he will do what Muhammad is doing do you think a man he is normal and he is his brain is functioning he will do such a mad stuff and you know Muhammad now is taking shower with this water after the shower is he cleaner when the blood of women covering him or the blood of the dead dogs and the stinky water touch him you know when there's a dead dog or dead body in water that water will be full of bacteria and will smell so bad for very simple reason there's a dead animal there how in the world Muhammad he become a prophet this is a short video I wanted to share with you please share it with your friends feel free to download Tell everybody about what we do. The Muslims are working hard to flag my videos, but it's not going to work. Nothing will stop us. And actually, um, I'm trying to finish my new book soon, which is going to be about the apostle of Jesus and Islam. If you'd like to learn more, don't forget to read my books. You can get them from Amazon.com. Just search for Christian Prince. Or if you are from Germany, you can search Amazon Germany, and you will find all the list of my books in all languages. And if you are French, etc., uh, we have a new book which is released lately. It's called Sex and Allah. And we have uh, the, the second German book, too, which is published lately, too. This is all new. Uh, and Sex of Allah have two volumes, so feel free to get a copy of my books. Again, we will do a series of videos like this, very easy to download short topic and you can share it very easy very fast with your friends thank you very much for listening and may the lord bless you and this is was a christian prince with you and we say as always christ is lord and islam is nothing but a false stupid religion and to believe in such a garbage religion you have to be suffering from mental illness to take a shower in dead with dead dogs and women blood menstruation and garbage you have to be literally suffering from mental illness please leave your comment down in the text it doesn't matter which video which channel this video is uh, is, uh, is posted please leave your comment and be honest about the behavior of Muhammad and if you like to compare between him and Jesus and the wisdom of Jesus please feel free and if you are a Muslim you can defend your prophet please do your best we like to see your comment too so we can love at such a defense which doesn't never work thank you christ is lord islam is false and see you soon again bye bye